Mother's Day is right around the corner. And if you are looking for gift ideas and you're struggling to come up with them, we've got just the person for you. Trey Raj is a smart shopping expert. She's going to help you save some cash in the meantime. Good morning, Trey. Thanks for joining us on Your Day with Anna Coyman. Good morning. Thanks so much for having me, Anna. So first up, where can we find the deals for Mother's Day if we're, you know, trying not to wear a hole in our wallet in the process? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Well, good thing is with Mother's Day approaching, will we see? we'll see lots of deals in giftable categories for mom. One of the more notable ones for me is jewelry. Because jewelry is so expensive and it only goes on sale in earnest a couple times a year, which is Valentine's Day and Mother's Day, it's a great time to take a look at maybe something for mom, maybe something for yourself. So jewelry is one of my favorite categories for Mother's Day. And just think of anything else that might be giftable that comes in a gift set, a gift box. Those items will all be on sale and the discounts will increase as Mother's Day gets closer. Okay, but the supply obviously is going to go down as well. So if you want a good selection, you probably want to try to find somewhere in that middle middle zone. Um, yes, of course, yeah. diamonds are a girl's best friend, so I can understand why at Valentine's Day times of year and also Mother's Day, those would be on sale. What about costume jewelry? Because I love a good, you know, a good sequin that's a bit less expensive than a real diamond. Oh, I am with you. I love costume jewelry and costume jewelry is so helpful because it, it's less expensive, but it gives you that bling. And I think it's totally acceptable to give costume jewelry as a gift. And I would expect costume jewelry to be on sale prior to Mother's Day as well. Uh, of course, it's very common to give mom flowers and balloons or maybe a fruit arrangement or something like that. How do we find coupons for those staples that seem to be really popular this time of year as well? Sure. So what I would recommend is looking at your favorite deal site. Most deal sites will have either a Mother's Day category or they'll feature Mother's Day gifts right on their homepage. One of my favorites is Honey or PayPal Honey, and that's at joinhoney.com. They have lots of deals in all different categories. And actually, if you install their browser extension while you're shopping, little deals will pop up automatically. So you don't even have to do any work. But I would expect lots of deals around Mother's Day. Okay. And what about taking mom out to eat at a restaurant? You know, whether it's brunch, whether it's dinner, whether it's breakfast in bed, how can we save on food for mom? Yeah, so lots of restaurants will be having kind of brunch specials or prefix. I would look for things like that. Uh, Restaurants.com also has um, opportunities to save. They have coupons that you can buy that will save you along the way. And make sure also that you're paying with the right credit card. Many credit cards give you benefits for buying in certain categories. Food is one of those categories. So for example, the Bread Cashback American Express card, which I love, they give 2% cash back on everything that you buy. And that's a good basic card to have because you'll save 2% not only on food, but also gifts for mom and your purchases throughout the year. Yeah. So it really matters how we buy, not just what we buy. Very good. And Trey, exactly. where can we find out more information about you because you have deals, not just for Mother's Day, but you're looking out for us year round. Yes, and I do have two extensive Mother's Day gift guides that'll be going up a couple weeks before Mother's Day at truetray.com. I'll have gifts under 50 and gifts under 100. Amazing. Well, thank you so much for coming on Your Day with Anna Coyman. Always looking out for us. We love seeing your face pop up because we know we're going to be saving some money, honey. <laughs> have a great Thanks so much for having me. Of course. Now, if you enjoyed this segment here on Your Day with Anna Coyman, make sure you like, comment, share, save, subscribe, hit that notification bell so you find out when we release our next video. And I'll see you next time.